how Obafemi Hamzat reacts to Bayo Onanuga's tweet warning Igbos to stay away from Lagos state politics. In a recent interview with Arise TV, the Deputy Governor of Lagos State, Dr. Obafemi Hamzat, was asked to respond to a tweet by Bayo Onanuga, the Special Advisor and on Information and Strategy to Tinubu, in which Onanuga stated that Igbo should no longer interfere in Lagos state politics. Hamza said that if he had seen the tweet, he would have personally called Mr. Onanuga to discuss it and express his approval. He was also promised to investigate the matter and speak to Onanuga about it. In Hamza's words, Like I said, I didn't see it. I am serious. I know him personally, so it is something I could have called him and said, What are you doing? I will call him because it is wrong. It is just wrong. My mother lived in Zaria for 19 years and my father was the area manager of the, for the whole of the north for IBWA. I lived in Kano. My father has a house in Kano, so it is absolute nonsense and that should not happen. We all need to be very careful. Words do have consequences and such people should not say things like that. So I will talk to him if this is true. Well, what are your opinions on this? Make sure to like and subscribe and make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel. And don't forget to share this video with your family and friends so that they know what is going on and they can give their own opinions on this. Now, let's see what other people have to say about this. Onanuga, Tinubu is no coward. With good governance, Igbos will vote for Tinubu. Onanuga, are you from Ogun State? So why are you claiming Lagos? I have never seen someone like Onanuga. I am ashamed, I am ashamed that he is an idiotic and unreasonable Yoruba man that talks rubbish just to satisfy his paymaster. Somebody who is not known in his home Ogun State is attacking the Igbo who are seriously contributing to the development of Lagos State. When fools talk, you will know. Can that man, by Onanoga, be able to win councillor election in Lagos State? He is a stranger like every other Igbo person in Lagos State. He can't be more Lagos than Lagosian. Onanoga is just after his selfish interest. As the Igbos are settlers in Lagos, so also himself. Since he is not a Lagosian, why didn't he stay away from Lagos politics too? He attended many schools, agreed, but he is very uneducated. He is one of those that has never travelled outside the West. I pity his ignorance. The only thing I want to do is remind that man that Ibo fear no one and that he should be guided in his utterances. People like Onanuga evaporate to penury after a while. He is so bitter and has no reason to be in government. Hamzat, your damage control answers are top notch. I love your aura, but don't tell me you didn't see the post of Onanuga or didn't hear the wave of courses in Nigeria. Confused man with bitterness towards progressive tribe that God has blessed beyond human understanding. It is when an Igbo man came out to contest, suddenly became an enemy. When they voted for Hausa and Yoruba, they went an enemy. I don't know what it is that sin. We cannot just be realistic. Ethnic and religious division has finished Nigeria as a country. I wonder what to expect from such an opportunist. He is serving as an errand boy in a grab it and run it. In a grab it and run with it government. Of course, he will do everything to please his master in order to be relevant. If it is true that somebody of his status made that statement, then he should be fired immediately by the president. If not, he will create more enemy for the president than friends. Onanuga is filled with intemperate bile against the Igbos. He is dying of his angst, which has made life miserable for him. 
despite knowing someone like P. President Tinubu, you may be worthless and sad even when you are gathering millions of dollars. Take a look at him. You will notice that he is miserable. His countenance betrays him like a shadow. I think Onanoga is working against Tinubu's government. He is really working hard to cause fight between the Yoruba and the Igbo. But mind him that Yoruba as a whole cannot stand one state in the Igbo land. We are waiting to see how you and Aboki will end up. You must surely need the Igbos at last. I am satisfied with intelligent Yoruba response in the comments to another post. With this, I am still believing in this country, Nigeria. One day, God will bless us with a good leader that will unite this country. Well, these people have all given their opinions on this. Make sure to leave your own opinions in the comments down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel. And don't forget to share this video with your family and friends.